we talk about all the time. You know, this is a, like we said, it's a 15 week process. And as long as you hit your stride at the right time, which is week eight, nine, 10 and plus, you are gonna be just fine. Again, not that we're trying to lose football games early, but <laughs> you know, if you lose, if you drop one and you get better from it, it's not a loss, which is exactly what we did in our two losses and you know, rattled off how many was it in a row, nine in a row to get here. And just, it's unbelievable. <laughs> it just, I'm still in shock. We started, we have a young defense, really young defense, probably four sophomore starters, which is unheard of here. Um, we just had to get them to buy into what we're doing here um, and ha have them realize that we're like a nasty team. We go after people. Um, and it took a while for them to get that, but when it came playoff time, when it mattered, it, it happened. And, um, and just like that, like that, people, we love each other and we're brothers. We hang out together and that's just what defines us. And you look at like our loss in Stonebridge. And then now we were a shell of what we are now. And that has a lot to do with the guys really buying into, this is a 15 week season for us. It's, that's the goal every time. And you know, not that we want to lose football games, but they, they grew up and that's what you talk about all the time. It's with the football program at Westfield. I mean, it's just a lot of those types of kids, blue collar kids, kids at work that win you championships, that win us championships. Yeah, a few weeks ago, I started having members of last year's team share something before practice started uh, about a moment or a memory or an experience they had last year that meant a lot to them. And one day before practice, Joey Free spoke to the team and he said, one thing I remember is every week we won, was another week that I got to get better and be part of something special and become a better, not only player, but a better person. And that's what you get out of five extra weeks, is another week every week to get better as a person and as a player. And for one of the players to recognize that, I thought was pretty special. I always tell our um, administration how appreciative I am that they understand the impact we can have on these kids. Maybe one of their teachers can't have that impact because of whatever reason, but because they're playing football and they love the game, I can have an impact or another coach can have an impact on them that might carry over into the classroom. Our character and just hard work and uh, just life skills. And football is a really special sport and it teaches all, all of that. You gotta be accountable. Uh, you gotta be on time. You gotta fight through adversity. You gotta do it not, you gotta be unselfish. You gotta do it not just for yourself, for the other people around you. Uh, you gotta understand that you're part of something special and, um, and, and something bigger than you. Uh, and to watch some of these kids grow, kids who at the beginning I might have said, hey, this is not for you. If you can't come to practice on time, you can't turn your paperwork in and, you know, d don't forget whether you're a football player or not. And to watch those kids grow and get it and buy in, uh, I think that's going to serve them well in the future. It's one thing to do it on the football field, now you can take it out and do it in life. <laughs>